What's up, Cloud Clone? I'm Cloud, and welcome to the beginning of our Pokemon Sweet Tooth Nuzlocke. Yes, I'm going to be doing a Nuzlocke of this. I probably going to pull up the type uh, sheet that shows weaknesses and resistances because I don't want to just completely lose really quick and we'll have some sort of incentive to take along with us in the journey. So, Nuzlocke rules basic. If something dies or if something's knocked out, it's, it's considered dead and we put it in the PC forever. Uh, we have to nickname all of our Pokemon and then the first Pokemon in each area can only be caught. Uh, if we knock it out or it runs away or something, we forfeit that encounter. Uh, and there might be, I don't know, static encounters in this game or not, but uh, I think that's about it. We can go ahead and get into it now. This is, I believe, a sequel to Sweet uh, that we did play quite a while back. I have a list of features up over here, but we'll get into that in just a moment. Hello there, glad to meet you. Welcome to Sweetland. My name is Sakcherum. Sakcherum. Yup. Though some call me Nutcakes, I'll call you Nutcakes. This world is inhabited by creatures called Poke Sweets. For some people, they are pets; others use them for baking. As for myself, I study Poke Sweets. Yes, indeed, you do, Nutcakes. But first, tell me a little about yourself. Are you a boy or a girl? We're a boy. What is my name? Yada yada yada. We are Cloud. There we go. Yes. That is us. It's my assistant. He has a passion for sweets, just like I do. His name is... Let's see. So our rival... I'm gonna call you Hanzo. Yes. Hello, Hanzo. Yes, his name is Hanzo. So annoying. Cloud, your very own sweet legend is about to unfold. A world of dreams and adventures with dessert awaits. So let's go. Alrighty then. So we're in bed. Do we have anything in our PC? Oh, I need to change the text speed. Uh, withdraw. There are no items. Okie dokie. Nope, we're not doing anything. We're done. Okay, can I go? Can I? I think I need to change my options menu real quick. Hey, that's better. Alright, so. That's us. Option is what we need. We want this uh, fast. Let's see. What frame looks nice for this? I was gonna go with blue, I suppose. Yep, yep, we're good, we're good, we're good. Let's move on. Move out. Hello, mother. Surprise, happy birth. You're about five months early, mom. You didn't forget it was today, did you? No, but I think you did. Your friends are here too. They're hanging around. They all brought presents. Go ahead and open them up. Ooh, we're starting this off with presents. Happy birthday, Cloud. I wanted to buy you a sweet, but all they had was the sappy Valentine stuff. Those red velvet dresses look nice, but they're expensive too. It's funny because I think I'm going to be uploading this on Valentine's Day. It wasn't really planned, but I was going to be uh, recording this really soon, so I was like, why don't I just upload on Valentine's Day just because? I still got some soda pop in that present. Yay! Hey, Cloud, happy birthday. I couldn't get you anything this year. I'm broke. That's what I get for eating all my chocolate coins. Thanks, man. No chocolate coins for me. Running shoes. Thank goodness. Cookbook. That is the Pokedex in this, I believe. Oh, let's talk to you, I guess. Happy birthday, Cloud. You know, I never thought about it before, but this town really gives Sweet 16 a whole new meaning. Oh, so we're 16 in this game, huh? Is there anything in this PC? No, there's not. Okay. I'm guessing that's mom's room then. She actually has a room. Imagine that. Alright, we're all good here. Nutcakes. Hello, Cloud and happy birthday. I'm Professor Sakshiram. I study Poke Sweets. You see, have you seen one before? They are adorable dessert creatures. They have a natural instinct to feed pastries to anyone they see, but in great numbers. They can pose a threat to our fitness. So we humans capture and train them to defend ourselves. Oh. I must have been rambling again. I'm terribly sorry. Are you having a good time? I have a gift for you, too. I couldn't bring it, however. It is at my house. I hate to trouble you, but 
could you drop by to pick it up? My house is in the southeast part of town. You can't miss it. I'm sure you'll like my gift. I'll see you later. Ooh, Cupcake Town. Let's, let's explore a little bit. I want to be an artist, but I don't have a canvas. Huh, I know. I'll make a sculpture out of a chocolate bowl boulder. I just have to get one all the way over here. Say, could you find me a chocolate boulder? Just push it there right in front of me. Oh, okay. And I'm guessing we can't leave. Yep. Sorry, the mountain road is closed off. There's been a landslide. Candy boulders are everywhere. They're too heavy for a human to move them. Maybe the right Poke Suite could do it. All right, so that's hinting that we need to push it down for this dude here. And he'll make a sculpture. As you know, berries make the best of sweets. I want to make a really nice parfait, but I need berries. Could you bring me an orange, petra, and cherry berry? Don't worry, I'll share my parfaits with you. Alrighty. Cupcake forest. I'm guessing we can't go this way. The forest path, the forest path is covered in overgrown berry bushes. I don't think it'd be possible to eat your way through. Maybe if a pokey sweet could whip the bushes out of the way, and you're not gonna let us pass. You're not gonna let us pass either. Alright. And this is... Oh, Pie Islands. Did we talk to you? I don't think we did. Berries can be used to bake treats for your Poke Sweets. You can do this at any kitchen sink. You should try it. Try making a Poke Block from an orange berry, then show me. Alright, is that it? That's here? Nope, what's this? Shop. We can't talk to you from behind the counter? Okay. Hello, Cloud. I had a fun. I had fun at your party, but now it's back to running the store. Sigh. We're not that fancy, but we have your basic needs here. What do you need? We could buy sweet balls already. Yeah, we're not. We're gonna wait on that. We'll come back here after we get our gift from the professor. I think. Oh no 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 no. I think that's it. We just go in here and we're good. Hello, Cloud. Welcome to my lab. My gift is there on the table. It's a Poke Sweet. That's right, a Poke Sweet of your very own. Sweet, huh? Ah, but you see. Though there are three here, I'm afraid I can only give you one. You see, these two kids are also receiving Poke Sweets, but it's your birthday, so you may go. You may pick one first. Go ahead. All right, so I'm gonna let you guys choose which starter we're going to be using. And according to this feature list over here, let me see if I can find it real quick. Uh, Non-linear map. Depending on the starter you select, you will take one of three routes throughout the region. So that's really, really interesting. It gives it some uh, replayability, that's for sure. All right, so we got Brownie Soar here, which I really do like a lot. We got Straw Ender. And then we have Scorpi, which is what we started with in the first Pokemon Sweet version. Uh, ugh. I, there is one in particular that I want, but I'm not going to say what it is because I don't want to uh, sway you guys in your decision. But uh, leave in the comment section below which starter you would like me to choose. And also leave me nickname suggestions down below as well. There's also going to be a straw poll in the description so you can vote twice. Uh, once in the straw poll and once in the comment section like I usually do. So I'm really excited to start this. It's Like I said, it's been a little while since I've done something uh, ROM hack related or fan game made related. But anyway, we're going to go ahead and wrap it up here. Like I said, leave in the comment section below. Vote for your starter and all that good stuff. I hope you guys are excited. If you enjoyed, please remember to leave a like, comment, maybe even subscribe if you haven't already to become part of the Cloud Clan. That would be greatly appreciated. And I will see you next time.